What's up YouTube, Jeff back again, and today I'm gonna to show you guys some really awesome hidden audio modifications for your Samsung Galaxy device. I'm first gonna show you guys how you can turn off entirely um, the limit for the maximum volume on your Samsung Galaxy phones. And then I'm gonna show you how you can actually change the volume step limit and some other cool settings that apply to the media controls on your Galaxy device by using Sound Assistant which is a Samsung app that they don't really advertise too much, but is actually a really, really awesome application. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go into settings, and then we're gonna go into sounds and vibrations. Now, if you go to volume uh, and go to the very top here, the three dots menu, and go to media volume limit. This is hidden on purpose because Samsung does not want you to play with this. If you notice on your device, it's turned off by default. So if you go in here, you're gonna see that this is actually switched off. What you wanna do is switch it on and then turn this up from the default all the way up here in the orange. And that's gonna allow you to turn off that maximum volume limit that Samsung imposes on your Galaxy device. I know that annoys a lot of people and uh, it's just something that a lot of people wanna turn off, but Samsung really buries that in the settings. So it's not so easy to do. Now, if you have a kid or something using your device and you don't want them to be able to easily, you know, deactivate the setting, what you can do is you can actually go in here and set a pin that is required in order for them to turn this feature off. Um, and uh, that, of course, is something that you might want to do if you're sharing this device. I don't care about having the volume pin, so that's not something I would do. So that's the first tip. The second one is to enable granular controls over your volume and also add some other helpful things that allow you to control media. So if you go to the Galaxy Store, the Galaxy Store, not the Play Store, and download Goodlock, I've talked about Goodlock a lot on this channel. This is a suite of add-on applications and modules that Samsung makes. This is written by Samsung. Goodlock Labs is a division of their software department. Uh, and then you're going to open up Goodlock and you're going to want to install the module which is on the Life Up side, which is the second side of Goodlock, you're gonna to wanna to scroll up to where it says Sound Assistant. So you see here Sound Assistant. Uh, once you install GoodLock, you have the option to go to the store and install this. Uh, you guys can see the application right here in the store. It's got very good reviews. Um, this allows you to get more granular controls over your sound profile on your device. If we go back into GoodLock, we're gonna go ahead and choose Sound Assistant. This is what it looks like, the Sound Assistant application from within GoodLock when you first launch it. I'm gonna talk about several of these options, but the first one that I want to concentrate on here today is change step volume. It's right down here. What this allows you to do is select a step that the media slider will go up or down when you use the volume rocker up here to change your volume. Now the default is 10, which is really a little bit too much for me in general and for a lot of other people, which means that when you do control this, it's going to end up being a little bit of annoying because you can't get the granular control over the volume you want. What you can do with Sound Assistant is you can change this to any step size that you want, all the way down to one if you would like to. However, I like to leave it at five, which means that when I do this, you'll notice that it's going to take it up or down by five increments as I go through the volume slider. I think that's much easier for me. It also allows me to get the volume exactly where I want it. It's my favorite feature of Sound Assistant. You'll also notice that the volume now goes all the way up to a maximum of 150, which you guys can see right there, uh, which is another thing that you were enabled earlier when we took off that maximum limit that Samsung imposes on the device out of the box. So a couple other things you can do, which you guys probably noticed there on my phone, is you can customize the volume panel with colors that you want, completely custom, and you can also make the volume panel a little more uh, engaging or useful for you by including things like a floating button over here. Uh, in the expanded panel, you can also do things like include Bluetooth metronome here. Uh, you can add a lot of features in addition to uh, changing what exactly colors wise you have inside the volume panel. So this is a fantastic option that lets you take control not only of your colors, but also of that information that's in the volume panels. Down here is the colors option you'll see here. Uh, one thing I've noticed is there's been some bugs where the colors that preview here are not actually the colors that are on the theme. You guys will see I have this theme enabled 
which is actually a lime green theme to match my lime green S23 Ultra, but that's not the color shown in my theme there. Anyway, to control this, uh, to edit the theme, you just hit the plus button, go in here and you can edit all these colors. These little circles show you exactly which colors you're editing at any given time. Uh, that is installed using the theme park application with Goodlock. So you wanna make sure if you want to modify the colors that you do have the theme park application, which is another Goodlock add-on installed. Uh, you can also change the individual app volume. So you can add specific apps that you want to default to specific volumes. Control the media volume with your volume rocker instead of the call volume. Uh, this is very, very useful for me. I very rarely do I want to control the ringtone, but I always want to turn media volume up or down. So I always keep this on. Um, media manner mode will basically mute media volume as well if you change your phone to vibrate or mute. I have my phone on mute a lot because I work as a math professor, so I cannot have it on during lectures. I don't like to have this on though because I also don't want to mute my phone when I want to watch YouTube later. Um, it can be a little bit annoying, but that's just a personal preference thing. Uh, control music with the volume keys. This will basically allow you, uh, when the phone's in your pocket, you can control your music going forward or back on tracks just by pressing that. You can set a favorite media app to integrate with uh, the Bluetooth uh, settings that you have in the volume panel. You can change some other advanced settings here, uh, like alerts through headphones here. And you can also enable multi-sound, which allows you other apps to play apps at the same, you know, sounds at the same time. So you could have like YouTube and Twitch playing sounds at the same time. If you want to watch a YouTube video on an external display um, while you're watching a Twitch stream on here, you could do that as well. Uh, I will usually enable this, but you do have to enable at least one app to do it. So you could say like YouTube and YouTube music. You could also choose all apps if you really wanted to. Um, and then any of the apps would be able to do this. I don't know if that's necessarily the best idea, but you can in fact do that. So some really cool features in here that let you really take granular control of the audio on your Galaxy device. Again, I enjoy using these settings mainly because uh, it lets me get more control over those step volumes uh, once I enable the maximum volume limit removal from within the settings like I showed you guys earlier. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification icon for future videos like this. I appreciate you guys checking it out and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks a lot for watching.